could have, it, it could have, you could have, uh, sort of, it, it could have had a different character. So then, um, step two in the resurgence, the film stuff. Yeah, that was written at, uh, at my flat, probably in sometime late '95, um, that autumn '95. And Brett said, I think you said it was an idea that you'd originally had for being the flash boy. Yeah, it was. It was a, it was a, it was a, a, a sort of singing similar sort of thing over doing flash boy, and I, I came. Rich's house. I said I just just sung him the melody, obviously without the without the without the, uh, the music. And I just tapped him on his ear, and, and, and Richard was sort of like just doing. And we kind of wrote it quite quickly, didn't we? One of those yeah, really yeah, nice yeah. afternoons where we just sat sat and wrote a song, and it was like turned around like, oh my god, this is actually really good. Mm -hmm. and we came up with the, kind of like the, the chorus bit. Yeah, and, yeah. Just and it kind of came together. Sort of there was a kind of slow, lumpy home demo of it, but it only came together properly when, when we did it, went to the church and recorded it there with, That's you know, right, yeah. with the whole band. That was a really good demo. That yeah, it was great. That was an albatross, that demo. In fact, we, we ended up taking the guitar stand off it, didn't we? Was that Probably. Shitty? That's true. That was shitty. Yeah. So the demos were, were, it was the first album that they'd actually demoed the tracks to a pretty high standard before, you know, all the previous records with dictaphones and. Is it Richard, you seem to be giving the impression of someone who wasn't really sort of um, having too much trouble stepping up to the plate. Well, yes and no. I mean, the actual they, the songwriting did come together really easily on coming up. It was like after that that it got more difficult. But um, I think I just had to sort of keep my head down, and get on with it, and not think about the bigger picture. Just you know, basically. Um, work through it, you know, work with the, the goal of having an album at the end of it that we're all proud of, you know. Was there kind of rising relief among the rest of the band at this point? Yeah, I think so, yeah. It was the yeah. first album I did that. I remember everybody having a great time. <laughs> it, the, the, it was a lot of fun making that record. Mm. There was a sense of total enjoyment. Mm. I, I, we'd been on the road for God, two years? Mm. Yeah, much. Much. yeah, it was a long time, yeah. Since, uh, since Richard joined, which in one way was great because I think, you know, we were playing really well together and all those things that you need to do to be a band chemistry and stuff uh, needed to be there. But at the same time, it's such a fucking relief to not be playing kind of, you know, Dogman star songs in, you know, Bangkok or whatever, you know, it was just... You know, to actually get in there. Um, one of the things, we didn't really know whether it was going to work. You know, we, uh, before we did the album, we'd done kind of like B-sides, and that's it. So yeah. I think yeah. there was a, a kind of relief about halfway through, and it was just like, I thought this is going to work, you know what I mean? Mm. And then by the end of it, it's kind of like, you know, just knowing you've got this thing, no one's really expecting it. It was quite a great thing.